for both teams. Uh, uh, Muncy Bogues does a tremendous job of, of forcing point guards away from what they like to do. Kendall Gill. Maiden fees inside to Sean Kemp. Larry Johnson has the defensive assignment on him, and Peyton left open for the outside shot. Is trying to post up, and he's got a tough job. Larry Johnson, steal Gill. Gill made it happen. Gill against Bogues with a slam. Yeah. Shrimp for the Sonics. That very shot that Larry Johnson missed was a kind that got him in a negative mode against the Utah Jazz. Kendall Gill is ready to play, and he is active and in the passing lanes. Got a piece of that. Peyton just flips it out. It's a no contest between Gill and Muggsy Bogues as he comes over the top. But uh, he really uh, is ready to play this afternoon. It's going to be a tough ball game for who out of the basket area. Larry Johnson was slow in getting across. State player, first round draft choice was the second pop, but no call, and Alonzo still perfect. Four for four from the floor. Nice oh, what a shot by Sean Kemp. Peyton hit him. Gill blocked. Morning with an outlet to Bogues that's stolen by Peyton. Gill. First miss of the day. Inside presence, and we'll find out whether they, they go to him down inside to occupy Alonzo Morning. Peyton nice. floats it over Morning. 250 left in the first quarter. Peyton in a hurry. Laid it in. They don't stop the ball, and Peyton does. Can't hit. Shrimp with a rebound. You think uh, Bogues remains out of the game because that bruised thigh is bothering him? Now they want to give him a little bit of Kowski with a save. Skip it across court to Hawkins. Missed it at the shot clock buzzer. Askew on the run out, played it in. Out there and Shrimp with another rebound. Now, this is the team we saw on Friday now. They've only got six points in this quarter after getting 40 in the first and signing on a roll. Point game. Askew, good cut. If you don't pressure the ball, you're going to be able to get passes inside, and that's what happened that time with Askew able first half. You give any team two and three possessions in the NBA, and eventually you're going to get burned. Peyton trying to make it up and does. Morning open jumper. Baseline shot had a funny rotation on it, kind of a sideways rotation. And Gill takes it to Peyton the other way. Peyton lays it up again. Long. They're doubling every time the ball goes down to the post on either Johnson or Kemp Steele, Kendall Gill. Gill undressed Muggsy and finds Peyton for the layup. Beautiful play by Kendall Gill. Terrific de defensive work by Kendall Gill. You, when you've got to have quick hands and you also have to be able to control the ball against Muggsy Bogues, he's able to get it, control it, and Gary, Gary Peyton converts it. Gill against Hawkins. Muggsy reached in, he almost got it back. Big, big uh, advantage here in the third quarter of play. An easy opportunity. Again, green back. White points back for the Sonics. Morning couldn't handle the pass. Here's Peyton. Now you see that uh, Gary Peyton was reinserted into the game because they weren't getting the ball handling. They had the turnovers have hurt them, but Gary Peyton reads this one very nicely. And it's Nate McMillan strong to the hole. Gill on the screen to answer yes, no, excuse me. Peyton got a step. That'll be a goaltend call inside the force or tougher shot. And you can see his reaction is to try to make a block after it comes off at the goaltend. Johnson has had 11 in the quarter, so both of them have been big and every guy in that uh, situation. Every shot he's taken has been good. Uh, best record ever if they continue. Eddie Johnson can't get that one to go. This will be a big home or a away court victory for the Sonics as Peyton lobs to Kemp for the for Muggsy Bogues, but this is the connection that has been electrifying for those in Seattle the entire oh, season. And look, I'm, I'm going to play in pain, do whatever it takes. 12 seconds left. 
the spurts in the second and third quarter and not taking good said they've got firepower galore with Curry Johnson coming off the bench 